Does every, every, everybody know what time it is? Tools That's right, Bim for Tools is proud to present Space Rogue. That's right, it's tool time again. As we pointed out last week, folks have been saving up for Black Hat and DEF CON and B-Sides. Well, CON is now here, and we were right. Tons of tools this week. First up, Microsoft has released a beta for the next version of Microsoft Security Essentials. Security Essentials is a free tool set for any Windows user to protect themselves from the malware that plagues the world of Windows computing. Best of all, it seems to be just as good as any commercial antivirus, which of course isn't saying a whole hell of a lot. If you're looking to crack the A51 encryption on GSM networks, you'll need a copy of Kraken, which uses rainbow tables to break the encryption of GSM cellular phone calls. Of course, you still need to intercept the call and hope it's not using A53 encryption, but this is a good start. Packet Fence 1.9.0 was released last week. Packet Fence provides network access control oriented features such as registration of new network devices, detection of abnormal network activities, including from remote snort sensors, isolation of problematic devices, and remediation through a captive portal. Nmap has a new version out just for DEF CON. And map 5.35 DC1 comes with 17 new scripts and over 260 new OS detections, not to mention a whole bunch of other stuff. And now you too can have all the security of a Brazilian banker with a new release of TrueCrypt 7.0. Version 7 introduces the encryption of Windows hibernation files along with hardware acceleration for AES. Nikto 2.1.2, a web server scanner which performs comprehensive tests against web servers for multiple items, including over 6,000 potentially dangerous files and bad server configs, has just released its latest version. Not sure if Dynamics just wants to be in tool time every week or what, but they've updated PDF to Sector once again to version 1.4, so update your copy or pick it up for the first time today. Probably a better deal than your AV software was. Herald Scan 0.42 is all the rage this week. Herald Scan is a Unix based Bluetooth scanner that is able to determine major and minor device class and attempts to map MAC addresses to determine the by vendor via BNAP BNAP. It even includes binary distros for Linux and OS X for the computing challenged. Shell of the Future is a reverse web shell handler. It can be used to hijack sessions where JavaScript can be injected using cross site scripting or through the browser's address bar. It makes use of HTML5's cross-origin requests and can bypass anti-session hijacking measures like HTTP-only cookies and IP address session ID binding. The Backtrack development team has prepared an extra special treat for this year's Black Hat attendees, the R1 release of Backtrack 4. There have been a lot of new additions and enhancements to this version. It has a new kernel, massively improved hardware support including support for new wireless drivers, lots of new tools, and other goodies. If you're going to be a black hat, stop by the offensive security table to pick up an actual copy of the distro. Jeremy Brown will be presenting Sploitware at DEF CON 18. Sploitware is a tenable framework dedicated to vulnerability analysis of SCADA systems. Phew, that's a lot of tools this week. That's it for this week's Tool Time. Join us next week for our salute to Tool Time.